I have an itchy nozzle. Hello everybody, so today I'm going to be doing a get ready with me and the reason why I'm introducing my video like this, sitting down and talking to you, is basically a disclaimer <laughs> because in my vlog that I uploaded which was my concert vlog, in my concert vlog I was originally going to wear this to my concert but the Oli Mers concert I went to, I actually wore my black top. As you can see, when I'm doing my makeup, I'm wearing this top. So just a quick disclaimer before you guys watch this video that this top was originally supposed to be in the video, but I got foundation on it. It had a massive orange splodge all over it. I couldn't put it in the video and I couldn't wear it out. So I really hope you guys enjoy this Get Ready With Me to Oli Mers' concert at the O2 in London. I really hope you enjoy this video and let's get started. Whoa! We're going to do our makeup, so I'm just gonna do I'm just going to cleanse my face and I'm going to moisturise it. I'm then going to be minimising my pores with the Prime Magic by W7. And then we're going to be using my True Match foundation in the shade Vanilla Rose. Real Technique Sponge. I'm just going to wet that with my Vitamin E face mist from Body Shop. Get some of these. Put it on my hand. Probably too much. Oh well. Next we're going to be using my Garnier Roll-On. This is actually the Garnier Skin Active Clearly Brighter Anti-Dark Circle Roll-On because they don't sell it anymore because it's annoying. They discontinued it. It's very sad. The collection Last Imperfection Concealer like in a cool medium too. That's going to go underneath my eyes. I'm going to get this Royal Match Perfection, shake it so it sits on the lid. Actually, let's do my eyebrows first. Let's do my eyebrows first. So, Natural Collection Eyeshadow in Crushed Walnut with my Angled Shadow Brush. They definitely aren't as dark in real life than they are on camera right now. We get that powder in the lid, bloop, 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 and then put it on my face and on my brows as well because sometimes my brows get too dark. Then we're going to get the Body Shop Eyebrow and Brow and Lash Gel and I'm going to run that through my eyebrows. I'm going to get a bit of highlighter, Jeffree Star Cosmetics. This is a new addition to my makeup family, pretty happy. This is in the colour, let me get a brush there. This is in the colour Ice Cold and it's just like a white highlighter. I'm going to use the setting brush, dab that in there. I'm going to use my babies, my Tarte palettes. I'm going to use a Tarte Lip and Bloom palette. If I can open it. <laughs> Base shadow brush, and I'm going to be going in with the oh, Flower Child, which is ah, this colour. I'm going to be going in with Flower Child, and I'm actually going to go full on and actually use a white um, eyeshadow, which is from the Body Shop, which has got a shimmery pigments in it. And then I'm just going to put that on the base of my lid as well. I used to do this all the time and I feel like it makes your eyes really pop. The Nancy Blending Brush and I'm going to be going in with, I think we'll go in with Jet Setter first, which is this one here. I might use my Angle Shadow Brush instead because that seems to work much better. Reef, which is this, this colour. And then we're going to be using Activist, which is a dark brown, which is the darkest brown in the palette, which is this one. Uh, Abyss, which is the darkest colour. Did I use Reef or Abyss? I can't remember. Well, we're using it anyway. We're using Abyss now. And the base brush. And I'm going to go underneath my eyebrow. Stila Stay All Day Waterproof Eyeliner. I'm going to do this off camera because I'm not very good at eyeliner on camera. Not even at all, but they will do. <laughs> Mascara. Now to do my hair. 